three. Welcome back to Homesteading with the Heberts, guys. Um, real quick, we just wanted to show you something. We weren't sure. We found out that our bunnies are male and a female, but we weren't sure if one of them was pregnant, so we put a nest in a little while ago. She or a nesting box made of cardboard. She destroyed that. But this morning, we woke up and we found these guys in the nest. So I'm creating a new nesting box for her. And we're hoping they're going to do okay. I'm just going to put them back into the uh, cage here with the mom. And then we're going to separate the mom and the dad. So we got there. We got the dad up there right now. And we completely separated them. There's four babies. We got a total of four. We got this all black one. Uh, We're trying not to touch them too much. I moved them with a piece of top, paper towel for now. And I have to look up what to do with babies now. Uh, if any of you guys have rabbits, please make a comment in the below. And let me know what to do. Hey, Jaja. Hey, little man. Look at the baby bunnies. I know you want to hold them. He's loving the baby bunnies. Don't don't be touching them. I'm not touching them. I'm touching it around it because that one looks like it's bleeding. Mm. Like his nose? Yep. Yep. He might be. He I found. The... I actually found this guy outside mm. of the cage. Mm. So we're hoping he, he makes it okay. We do have a cat. So I'm hoping the cat didn't get to him. Because, like I said, I found him outside the cage, just sitting on the floor. So I moved him out, and or I put him back in and filled this box with all the fur that the rabbit has ripped out. We thought she had a false pregnancy because she's been ripping her fur out for about three weeks now. So it's been a while. Um, from everything we had read, it usually happened in about a week before. So now we're just gonna put them back in the cage. I'm gonna drop their mom so the mom can be with them. I think she was running away from them because of the dad was, when I came down this morning, the dad was uh, all over her. Uh, she's on the, here, hold this. Oh. That's fine, just put those down from right now. No, it's fine, go ahead. No, go, give those to your mommy. Little cute rabbit. You still need me to hold it? Yeah, hold it right here so I can on the side of me. See, look at the rabbit. I'm gonna take the food away from her for a minute. And I'm gonna drop it. Okay. She knew to move. I'm gonna drop the door. That's how we can separate them in this cage. And we'll see if she goes down to them. Now we're gonna have to set up a water for the, both of them. Oh, she's gonna go to the food that's up here. She's being lazy. Give me that food. I don't know either. I don't want to handle them too much because sometimes with human scent on them and different animals, but these guys should be okay with that. Seeing that they smell like it? Yeah. They're used to each other. We touch them all the time. Oh, she just went in the box with the babies. All right, guys, thanks for coming along. Um, we're going to go ahead and keep you guys updated on these guys every once in a while. Um, and hopefully they do well. All right, thanks. Bye.